Hey, how you doing? This is Mark Hall, owner and trainer of Fuller Fitness, and this the focus of this video is to um, is on uh, increasing your strength with bands. And the interesting thing about uh, increasing your strength with bands is the fact that I believe you can do it without it taking a long period of time. Um, regardless of how strong some of us may be, regardless of how strong some of us are trying to get, you can do that with bands. Um, with high hopes, your focus isn't on popularity, but so with the bands, if you can see the slack that I have, if you do that, one, it's a waste of time. Two, you'll be able to do a bunch of reps with it, but what's the point? Uh, so if you can see, I have it straight. There's no slack in it. So now once you do it, <clears throat> you should be able to show the difference depending on which bands that you're using. Um, in terms of the resistance. So if you can see I got a black and an orange band The black one is equivalent to 40 the orange one is equivalent to 30 until I get the other another uh, 40 um, <clears throat> To challenge myself in, in the ways that I want to so again you stand back make sure there's no slack in the band then it's up to you on how you do it if you one at a time like I do because I like to make sure each one counts as one and I think I'm going to do one more which is interesting because before I don't think I was able to use that much resistance to do much of anything um, with these bands so again um, for those who are trying to get stronger, it is an awesome opportunity, whether you're using bands or not, to surprise yourself. That is an awesome feeling, being able to surprise yourself when you're doing stuff. So again, if you make sure um, to use these... Um, and again, if you're doing back, chest, shoulders, whatever it is, to make sure you're not cheating it, it's, it's very hard to cheat. And then whatever it is you're doing to cheat, that's just stupid. So again, if you have slack in a band and then all of a sudden you start doing this and you do 40 reps, hopefully mentally you should already tell yourself how stupid that is. Um, and hopefully just instead of cheating, just use a different band different bands a different band I have two and again even though it don't seem like much the more you stretch it the more you feel it um, and not only that the fact that you'll be able to do so much more with these without it taking a long period of time so And then, and, you know, that, that includes for those that seem, you know, from what I've noticed at 38 years old, there are certain things I noticed uh, in the past compared to what I notice now uh, in terms of how, um, you know, and, and maybe it doesn't matter as far as this video, but with all the people that I saw have seen at the gym over the years, and it's not just ladies doing it anymore, uh, whether that matters or not. But so many people doing circuit training and so many people do, or uh, supersets and possibly circuit training and, you know, grabbing three or four sets of dumbbells, especially when you're doing stupid stuff like that at the gym, grabbing multiple sets of dumbbells as if nobody else needs to use dumbbells. But um, and doing all this different stuff. So as far as this, you get to, you know, do all this different stuff without having to grab all these different dumbbells. Again, this isn't saying that anything's better. But to use this and being able to surprise yourself, because then, again, if you haven't heard me say this in any of my other videos talking about bands, to be able to do uh, certain things with this and... Um, Giving yourself the opportunity to surprise yourself of what you can do, especially if you use bands at least for a certain period of time, 
and then you go back to using uh, dumbbells, bars, dumbbells, bars, whatever it is that you might use. Um, some people use bands and dumbbells, bands and bars together. But again, if I use one, I'm using just the one. So if I use bands, I'm using just bands. If I use dumbbells, I'm using just dumbbells. I've had certain people on, on uh, who asked me on YouTube, which is interesting because I don't think anybody on Instagram asked me that question. But on uh, YouTube, people asked me, hey, so, you know, when I did uh, one of my uh, videos where I chest pressed 148 or whatever it was, and somebody was like, how much can you bench? I don't, first of all, I don't know why people are asking me that. If, if a person uh, is lifting, you know, a certain amount on dumbbells, I'm not sure how that equates to where all of a sudden a person has to ask how much you can do with a bar. So, you know, maybe it's just me thinking that's stupid, uh, that people are asking questions like that. Maybe people are just different. Maybe I am uh, more of a weird person than I thought to where... You know, I don't have the temptation to see somebody lift a 180-pound dumbbell. I'm like, hey, how much can you do on the, on the bench with a bar? So maybe that's just me. So again, as far as this stuff, uh, being able to, you know, I just did three sets without it taking a long period of time. You know, if I wasn't talking, I'd be already doing other stuff. So again, this is just to hopefully help people get an understanding, especially if you haven't seen any of my other videos, that you can do more without it taking a long period of time and I'm gonna say this for the last time especially in this video it's not saying that it's better if you do it and you find it to be better go for it because I do both I do the bands I do the dumbbells uh Monday Tuesday depending on when you see this Monday Tuesday actually regardless of when you see this on Monday Tuesday and Wednesday specifically of this week I was using dumbbells today is Thursday depending on when you see this Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I plan on using bands. Uh, why doesn't matter at this point, but again, uh, I, I do both. So, you know, in fact, I think I'm going to do that more often to where Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I'm going to do dumbbells. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I'll do uh, bands and try to see, because I haven't done that before as far as I remember. So, uh, so just to, one, it helps to... It's less stress on your body to use bands. A lot less stress on your body to use bands as long as you're not doing anything that your body can't handle. Especially if you're trying to shoulder press certain bands that you can't handle and you keep trying harder than you should to do it and then you end up hurting your back. So, But for the most part, if you're using bands, you shouldn't get hurt from it. If you do, you did something really stupid. So hopefully you either uh, give yourself time to... Uh, Respect what you're using, learning how to use it as best as you can. I've been doing it for at least 20 years, if not longer, probably longer. Um, so, you know, um, and then not only that, <clears throat> if you haven't seen any of my other videos talking about this, the, the more you stretch the band, the more you feel it. So like I said, if you start and you have slack in the band and then try to do 40 reps, well, one, that's stupid, two, uh, that's not helping at all, which, again, stupid. So, uh, you know, just give it a chance, you know, uh, especially if you're younger. But regardless of your age, give it a chance, one, to uh, give yourself the opportunity to be pleasantly surprised that you can do certain things that you didn't know you can do, especially if you do bands for a certain period of time and then all of a sudden go back to dumbbells, bars, whatever it is that you use, and all of a sudden realize you are a little bit better because there you should stimulate your muscles in different ways, dumbbells and or bands, um, and then figure out how good you become uh, while doing certain things. So like I said, give it a chance if you haven't already. Um, this isn't to sell it. Um, I don't even have anything to where I can't uh, sell bands at least. So give it a chance. I think you'll like it. Uh, I think you'll like the way you look. I think you like the, you'll like the way you feel. 
on a regular basis, depending on how long you do it. Um, and you don't have to spend a lot of money to, to, to get them. So um, the bands that I've been using most of the time, most of this time over the last 20 or more years is body elastics. And you can, uh, you know, depending on what you have going on with friends, family, roommates, whatever it is, all of you should be able to use them regardless of how different, uh, what the difference is in strength level between all of you. So, um, give it a try. Hope you enjoy it. This is my tone owner and trainer full of fitness. Take care.